The FBI needs your help tracking down a pair of bank robbers. The two struck again today. News Channel 5's Curtis Jackson joins us now with more on a disturbing trend. Cleveland many times before and most get caught. But what makes the latest two so unusual is that they're working together so successfully and that they are often hitting more than one bank each time. Have you seen this man? How about this one? Or this one? Or this one? A closer look reveals not four different men, but only two. And both are suspects in a series of tag team robberies. Basically, one will go in the first bank, rob it with a demand note. Then they'll go to another bank uh, shortly thereafter, rob it with a demand note with the second individual. The tag team bandits hit two banks in Euclid Monday. You could call them the Bonnie and Clyde of Cleveland. That's because one of the men appears to have dressed in drag during a previous robbery. Both are part of a national trend. We knew that we had a, uh, an upward trend in bank robberies at the end of last year. There were 55 bank robberies in Cleveland last year. Two months into 2011, there have been 17, and the tag team bandits are responsible for 12 of them. So far, no one's been hurt, at least not physically, and not yet. These tellers go through a very traumatic experience when they get robbed. They don't know if these individuals have guns. We don't know if they have guns. They indicate that they might have guns in their demand notes. With every getaway, the FBI says serial robbers get more brazen. And that raises the danger for everyone inside a bank at the wrong time. That's why the feds are seeking the public's help. There is reward money available, and uh, certainly want, we want to get them off the street. The Cleveland branch of the FBI can be reached at 216-522-1400. All tips are confidential. I'm Curtis Jackson, News Channel 5. New tonight, deputies made an arrest in connection with a bank robbery last week in Portage County. It happened Thursday morning at the Cortland Bank on State Route 44. The FBI says the robber, armed with a semi-automatic pistol, got away with cash and two die packs. The Portage County Sheriff, David Doak, said they arrested this man, 46-year-old Donald Kell Jr. of Manaway Township.